Sorry, All right. Um, I guess to start, just give me some thoughts on, on this game, you know, especially that second period, that, that big explosion there. Well, yeah, well, I think the big thing is, you know, we, uh, we got the power play going a little bit. I thought, uh, you know, we had some good chances, and uh, we got a little confidence we to settle things down. Uh, you know, I think they were a good, hard-working team, and we were fortunate to, uh, you know, get after it a little bit there offensively. And, I mean, obviously, you know, some guys had some big nights. Pete Child uh, with three goals from the point. So, uh, you know, we, we talked the last year about how strong our defense was, particularly uh, generating offense from the blue line of it. You know, we, we didn't necessarily think we'd see that, you know, duplicate of that, but it was tonight. It was very similar to last year, and I think we got four goals in the offensive tonight. John with, uh, with three, and, and Dean Kells with all so, uh, You know, anytime we're getting that, we're going to fire me or incorporate it into the offense. It's a good plus for us. Hey, is this the best team we've played this season? You know, it's it's hard to say. We've had, uh, you know, we've had some real good periods. Um, it's very difficult to say is it the best team we've played. Uh, you know, we haven't really had the same lineup in there every night or anything like that. So there's certain components that I think uh, we saw some things tonight that, that we moved the puck along the power play and, you know, had good zone time and, and, uh, and were a little bit uh, more patient with the puck, a little stingier with it. You have to work so hard to get it. So if we get it in there down low, we don't want to turn that thing over. But it's easy. So I think we're developing our offense a little better down low. But, you know, we're just always looking at trying to get a little bit better at things and, uh, each and every period that we play, but uh, you know, I think there was some definite uh, things that, that stood out to me. You, you mentioned earlier on in the season that this is a team that's probably not going to score six, seven goals in, in, a, in a game very often. Is this a huge confidence builder for you guys? Well, I think it is. Anytime you get a couple like that, uh, you know, we got some good shots, hard shots on net, you know, that, that were upstairs and, uh, you know, in traffic. I think we got to create traffic in front. We scored on some initial shots as opposed to rebounds and so forth. So that doesn't happen. Every night. You know, most of your goals are going to be in second and third chances, and those are tough to get. So, uh, you know, like I said, we the big thing is we got to really concentrate on the process and be willing to, uh, you know, really pay the price uh, down low and, 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 uh, and, and make sure we're doing the little things to, to sustain, you know, that kind of pressure you need. They're not going to go into the first and second shot sometimes, so we got to keep coming. But we did have. I think the big thing for us tonight, we also had good energy from line to line. And if we can keep four lines rolling like that, boy, that makes a big difference. Uh, two players had their first college goals tonight. You had Child, who ended up getting the hat trick, and then um, Carden. Ricky Carden, yeah, it's good to see you. I thought Ricky played real well tonight. And, uh, you know, anytime that happens, it seems to give a guy a real boost. I thought uh, I thought Nick Pizzacoulos had a real good game tonight. He was around the net all night. He made some really good plays and moved the puck well. So, you know, uh, I was really pleased to see that. I mean, we've got, we got guys that are hurt. We need the depth. We need to develop our bench strength. And, uh, you know, these are very difficult decisions for me each and every night because you know we get guys that, that are pretty good players that you know for every, any given night they might not be in the lineup and uh, you know the healthy scratch is tough you know you get you get a guy that's hurt obviously you can't play if he's under the weather but uh, you know the, the healthy scratch is a tough one and you know I, I think tonight some of the guys jumped in and you know weren't in the last last weekend and uh, they did a real nice job tonight so it's a, a, a credit to them and that's what we have to have we have to have the guys uh, you know really working hard during the week to be prepared and uh, you know that competition starts from within and that's you know we'll see a little bit of that tonight. And can you comment on that on that first line you had out there McKenzie played great I thought Flanagan even though he didn't he got on the stat sheet with the assist I mean he played phenomenal. I thought he was exceptional tonight I think he made plays and he's making them all night long he's, he's a very very uh, creative player he's, he's, he's really a, a, a very exciting he's a special player I mean, he moves the puck well his head's up all the time he's just a great passer uh, he was threading the needle tonight on some things, and uh, you know he's he's uh, he's a really special player. Uh, uh, but uh, you know he works hard, he battled hard. I thought that line did a great job. McKen uh, Cunningham's been out there flying around, and you know, he's got great speed. And, you know he's been throwing his body around out there, so he's uh, he's been a real catalyst. I think for that line as well. So, you know I certainly like what I've seen out of that. Is there anything else you wanted to add?